Hi there again. Once more, it's Martin Tyner and Alan Smith with you for this game, which, uh, well, we came to the ground, the weather looked okay, but we've been hit by snow flurries, and it's actually snowing as kickoff approaches. Yeah, it seems to be getting a bit heavier. It's if it starts covering up the lines and snow gathers on the ball, that's when the refs start a decision to make. Well, that's for Mites, hoping that they can reach the same heights again as they did in their away win against Borussia Dortmund. Yeah, the result never looked in doubt in that 2-0 win, and uh, I don't think it'll be in doubt for them today. I think they'll win. Harold Fimler, the match referee in charge. Yatabare. Oh, it's a try. Wasteful pass, unforced error, really. Turnover of possession here. Well, he really could be the star of the show today. Well, when he's on the ball, you know, he's as quick as anybody. Uh, almost as quick when he hasn't got the ball, so that's a real threat here. The game between the two earlier this season was an absolute thriller. It was just a home win, just... And now they're the visitors, and uh, I think it'll be very, very testing for them to repeat that. Yeah, it was one of the games of the season, easily. And, uh, well, whether we'll get anything like the same, I don't know, but let's hope so. Malik Vagfreda. He's moved in, trying to jostle the opponent off his stride. a useful ball in defender to it first well this attack got a bit of menace to it it could be a chance that is the first goal and it could be the one that actually shapes the destiny of the day I don't think he could have got that any further into that top left than he did there. So the first goal, it's 1-0. Free kick here. Support play from his teammates. And now the shot. He's going to blame the snow, I think. It, look, it looks nice watching it come down, but it's not too easy to keep your balance on. No, one or two of the players looking at the ref inquiringly. Aren't you going to call this off? Get on with it. Donati. in the build-up and a brilliant finish a wonderful goal and he took a glance up there you know and he saw the keeper's positioning really good cool composed finishing restarting at 2-0 wondering about the effect of the snow into the players eyes and seeing uh, as clearly as they would do if there was no snow well that's the thing isn't it if uh, it impairs vision and uh, if it gathers on the ball as well of course that's when the ref has to have a look at it Garcia
don't see that so often. Just and shoots so close to the hat trick. I think he took it for granted, you know, that he was going to score there and took his eye off the ball maybe at the last second. Selassie. Now that's a foul, and the player has already been booked. He can't fly in like that, he's already been booked. And the referee, I think, is going to give him the benefit of the doubt. You do wonder about footballers sometimes, and I'm wondering about him down there. And that will clear the danger. Gabriel Selassie. Blocked well by the defender. Out of Bremen's corner. Quick look at the goal again. Just looking at the keeper's reaction. It was a good height for him, but didn't move across quickly enough there. And there goes the whistle for half time. It's always tough for players when they are substituted. It's more, of course, uh, a regular occurrence these days with more and more subs being allowed, but uh, the crowd aren't helping, are they? Uh, you don't want to be taken off, and you don't want to be taken off in this sort of an atmosphere. You don't, but it comes with the territory, and the manager, I think, just feeling it's that time in the match where he needs a little bit more energy in that middle of the park. Presented the ball to the opposition. Not often, Alan, do you see one man have one half like he's had. On top of his game out there, and I'm sure he'll be thinking about grabbing his hat trick in the second half. You see a substitute coming on for the away team here. Garcia. Very difficult on this snowy top, isn't it, Alan? Yeah, it is difficult. And uh, the old orange ball comes out. And it can be quite fun, actually, playing in these conditions. Terrific play on the ball. Oh, lovely clean feet in a confined space. You could watch that over and over. Berta Bremen now have the ball again. It's a big call, this, for the ref after that earlier booking. Referee probably reluctant to send him off, giving him one last chance. Could have been a second booking. It's time for some fresh legs here. Here's right. Over to Fry. Oh, he's through. The keeper might be needed again. He didn't hang on to the ball. Yatabare. There's going to be a substitution. It's for the away team. Now it goes into the wider areas where they've got a winger waiting. The right. On EA Sports, we've got presentation of the Bundesliga fixture. Werder Bremen. They'll be facing Borussia Dortmund away from home. Yeah, I've had a lot of supporters get excited about it, and I am as well. Able to make a good interception. Well, he looks as though the uh, game has taken a bit out of him. This might be it! Well, he's 
just off target, tried to curl it with the outside of his foot. Yeah, it's a clever effort, didn't miss it by too much, good technique. Not a bad Try. Well, that is one of those performances that you mark down as the levels you're going to try and get to every game, but you can't do it. It was brilliant. Yeah, he more than anybody else has contributed to this lead that his team have got at the moment. Well, it didn't quite cause the problems that it looked as though it would that cross. And now the defending team can play their way out of trouble game can be influenced so often by substitutes the home team are going to perhaps gamble on that working for them now the players done well here until it was the direction of the pass really right idea but couldn't find his man it's out over the touchline Christian Clements got to try it. terrific stop they've got it away from the danger away from those trying to get there and turn it into a chance well that's it the final whistle well you don't have to dominate a game to win it this game is proof of that you certainly don't and the little score line in the top corner of the screen is what matters Bundesliga. Cologne won, Bayern Munich won, Eintracht Frankfurt won, Hanover nil, Augsburg nil, Borussia Dortmund nil, Schalke nil, Borussia Mönchengladbach two, Hamburg won, Offenheim won, Hertha Berlin won, Ingolstadt two, Stuttgart won, Bayer Leverkusen two, Werder Bremen nil, Mainz 2. Now let's see what effect that's had on the league standings. At the top of the table remain Bayern Munich with 63 points. In second, Borussia Dortmund with 54 points. In third, Schalke with 49 points. In fourth, rising up the table are Bayer Leverkusen with 48 points. In fifth and falling are Wolfsburg with 45 points. In sixth, climbing the table are Mainz with 42 points. In seventh, moving down, are Cologne with 42 points, but only behind on goal difference. And then reading up the table, second bottom, Ingolstadt with 18 points. Third bottom, Hanover with 20 points. Fourth bottom, Werder Bremen with 22 points. Fifth bottom, Hertha Berlin with 27 points. 